Okay, it's recording now. Uh, everybody close your laptop and give me your attention. Today is Tuesday, September 29th at 1.24 p.m. We are in fourth block, and this is uh, Principles of Engineering, the second level course. Uh, and, oh, I still need glasses. I still need glasses. All right, so put all, your, put all your parts down and put your hands down and just look at my screen while I try to demonstrate this system to you right now. Uh, so what I want you to see and what I want the people at home to see, and I'm recording this as well, is this is me. And if you were at home right now, Chase, you could see this. Like I'm hoping people at home can, uh, Sid, hey Sid, what's up bud, I got your email, yeah. Um, so what I'm hoping I'll be able to do if I, if I do this, then I can just teach the class and the people at home simultaneously. And then there, there's something else I wanna show you in, in just a minute. But you're used to all of this, you're used to uh, going to Schoology page, you're used to opening start here. Um, there is a new video there that you do not have to watch unless you need to figure out how to join a Schoology conference. Uh, the announcements right there. Uh, we did not have school yesterday, and I know you think, oh, we don't have school ever on Mondays, but you actually do. We did not have school, homeschool, no school at all yesterday. Uh, Matt, I told you to play video games and ride your bike. Did you do that? Yes. yes. Yes, that's excellent. That's excellent. He did that. He did that. Okay, so we didn't have school yesterday, so you should see, if you look at the Monday announcement, it should be like grayed out because that day does not exist. The day that does exist, though, is Tuesday, September 29th, 2019, Block 4 POE. What's late? These assignments are listed as late. I think, I think they're the same assignments that were listed as late last week. So if you didn't turn them in, you still have this, this time to turn it in. And then also notice it says Tuesday and Wednesday, one, two, three, snap, which is sort of this, the uh, assignment that we, that we dug deep to find. And then it is one, two, three, sim. And Sid, if you're watching, one, two, three, snap, uh, is where, that's the physical version of what we're trying to do because we threw out the Project Lead the Way physical version. And then sim, if you can't do snap at home, I want you to do sim at home and I think we'll be good. So that means one, two, three, snap is due this weekend. One, two, three, sim is not. It'll be due the following weekend. And just like I told Sid just now, whatever works, whatever you have to do at home to do these assignments, make adjustments to however you need to, to make them make sense, to make them meaningful for you. Uh, this is the time we have this opportunity to do this. The activity electric circuits physical. This activity we tried to do failed miserably and so now we're not doing it so do not worry about one two three uh physical one two three physical but instead we did one two three snap which i've now moved to week five one two three snap there is a a file that was uploaded here Pro, uh, not a project lead the way a powerpoint a powerpoint photo I'm hoping that when I click on this, it'll appear on the screen for the people at home and for the recording. And I don't know if anything's happening. Um, I clicked on it and it's bouncing. Okay. It's opening, all right. So the PowerPoint that's about, look, there's Sid. Sid, he turned this thing on. Um, so here's the instructions themselves. Make sure you make a notebook entry for this just like you would any. I actually took these these little photos, I, I don't know if they're photos or not, but these little schematics, and I cut and paste them into my notebook. I want you to literally draw them though. I want you to draw schematics and I can show you how to do that. Actually, I'm very excited to show you how to do that because uh, I got a new system set up here. So you will make those circuits, take photographs of them, answer the questions related to them, make sure you document everything in your notebook. I'm not gonna close that because I actually wanna show you what I mean by that. Uh, let me see, Where, does this, can I move this over here? You guys can see everything. That's a little unsettling. It just went away, it's gone now. Okay, that's scary. Uh, announcements, the, the physical we're not doing, the sim we will do next time, the snap we're doing today. And so when I say that I want you to draw in your notebook, I don't mean, I, do I want a, a color cartoon like this? I want a schematic that I will show you what I mean in just a moment. And then of course, the Schoology conference is right there. All right, I think I'm ready to show you my new, my new tool. 
that uh, took me like five hours to figure out how to use it. Okay, I'm gonna stop sharing. Okay, there's me. Hey Matt, it's me. And then I'm going to watch this. Uh, no, don't watch, watch this. Nothing's happening. Oh. Don't, it's okay, it's okay. Um, okay, so I'm still recording and I'm still broadcasting, um, but I needed to be able to like literally write, you know, because you guys have this notebook work that you're doing. Um, and so I needed to, to be liter literally be able to write on the screen while I'm recording, send it, sending it home to Schoology Conference and here it is. So what I'm gonna show you right now is what a electric circuit diagram should look like. Because you were already looking at those cartoon diagrams which really match the actual snap circuit parts. But when it comes time to draw a schematic, I want you to draw it the right way, the standard way that schematics are drawn. And wires are always drawn in straight lines, even though wires are actually pretty curvy. Uh, wires are always drawn in straight lines. And switches are drawn like, like doorways. So if you imagine, look, I just did something. Cody, see, I just did that. If you can imagine a door, if you can imagine a door there, this is a wire, that is a switch that is open, which means off, and then the wire continues on. When you close this switch, the electricity flows through the wire. Well, for a circuit to be a circuit, it's gotta have a complete, well, it's not a circle, because it's gonna look like a rectangle, but it's gotta have a complete path. And so I'm going to draw this and then make a wiggle thing. You see the wiggle thing? That is a resistor. I'm gonna put an R for resistor. I'll put a, I'm just gonna spell out switch, the switch there. And then on this side, I'm going to put this symbol. That symbol is a battery. And then I will put, let me try this. How about this? This is a light bulb. So this is a schematic. This is the kind of thing you should be drawing. Uh, the switch looks like a door. It's open or closed. Closed means it's on. The resistor, it does exactly what that sounds like. It resists the flow of electricity and resistors have a value like 100 something. I'll explain what the something is later, 100 something. And uh, the, the battery over here has a voltage. Whoa, that was weird. Has a voltage, let me just call that 9V for voltage. This is what a schematic should look like. Isn't that pretty? Make sure all the things that you make have a schematic like this. And if you're not sure what the symbols are supposed to look like, those are in the assignment or at least in the Project Lead the Way webpage. Now, this that I just did, this was really just an experiment of the actual tool that I'm putting together. So uh, you, can, you can draw something like that if you want. I'm going to, going to wrap up my recording here. I guess I'll go back to this. Will I, am I doing that? How about that? Look. So follow all the questions, all the uh, steps, build these circuits, take photographs of them, draw schematics, and work all class period. Is there anything else I should say, Kevin Conklin? Get to work, Get to work is what he said. That's very good. And so I, what do I do? How do I make that stop? How do I make that go away? Screen sharing is stopped. Okay, screen sharing is stopped. Stop recording.